Hello, this is Dave from Solvent Printer Conversion, and I am standing beside a nice, clean Roland SC500. This was Roland's first solvent printer cutter, and from the factory it was running an earlier generation of solvent ink, their Sol inks. We've gone through since we got it, and we've upgraded it to the latest Roland EcoSol Max inks. We've changed out a number of parts. It has new print heads, new capping station, new damper, new pump. Um, and we've gone through and checked on things. We've changed the cutting protection strip, the cutting blade, the cutoff blade, and done a number of calibrations. We're very pleased with this machine because it has very low use. On the clock, it's showing 550 print hours. It's not uncommon to see uh, this generation of machine with 5,000 print hours or more and still running strong. We just uh, converted a machine for a gentleman from Indiana just earlier today. His was running great, had 4,500 hours on it, so nine times more than this. Um, so basically, this one has a lot of life still left in it. This machine is a 54-inch wide printer and cutter, all in one. Um, we have built in our special uh, hot box media heating system, and this has front and rear media heat right under there. Um, we were just doing a simple little test print here, um, just to show what it can do. That's just on a scrim banner material. I'm going to hit our test print here, and um, you can kind of see, Justin may or may not be able to jump up on there, but basically we've got a, a nice clean test print. It looks real good. Um, we're very pleased with this. A couple examples of what you can do with this machine. Um, we print out retractable banner stands which is a nice uh, display piece. They can roll right up and uh, they're a good money maker. You can do all kinds of signage that you print on a pressure sensitive vinyl and then laminate uh, or stick onto some type of a board. Um, a popular product that people seem to like a lot, it's kind of a beat up sample, but is the one-way vision window film that on one side looks pretty much opaque on the other side, you can see out. It can be used on vehicle windows um, and other things. This, of course, because it is a cutter, and these are white, so they're kind of hard to see, but this is just cut vinyl. And you could go through and use this as your main vinyl cutter. Um, you can also go through, as we did here, with these stickers, and you could print and then cut out around, do a contour cut job. Um, you peel them off there. Oh. Them. So, Justin was just saying here, so you can kind of see, you know, these are a, a basically done as stickers. These are what we actually stick on our machines now. Um, so, this machine, it's a little bit newer. It's a little, little past seven years old, um, but it seems like it's just been used very little. Um, and that's good for you. Um, Kevin right now just set it up for some type of a print and cut job. Um, I'm not even sure what it's going to be, so it'll be a surprise. Looks like, oh, maybe our logo? No. No? <laughs> okay, I don't know. I'm just along it's for something. Pride. It's something. It's a surprise. So we'll see. But shortly here we'll be able to do print and cut. So basically, here at Solve Printer Conversion, um, we try to do things a little bit differently than the average used printing equipment salesperson. And here, we have a printing side called Better Banner Printing. Uh, we're taking orders every day. We're not a huge operation, but we've learned a lot of things about how to, uh, how to provide customers with quality products and keep them happy. And if you come here and you purchase a printer from us, we actually share, you know, share whatever suppliers we use, different media types. Um, we invite you to come in here and kind of get a peek at things. So if this is going to be a new venture for you or just an expansion of what you're already doing, um, maybe we can give you a leg up and help you avoid some mistakes that we made or you know, difficult, uh, difficult choices of what to do. Um, right now we're working on this uh, print and cut graphic. Um, right now you can see this is printing back and forth in what's called a super mode, which is a 720 DPI mode. It's one of the higher resolution modes. And with this machine, you can expect print speeds. It's not a, not a racehorse, but it will get the job done. So you can expect print speeds 20 to 30 square feet an hour on the common modes that we use, between 360 and 720 DPI. That's not as fast as a new machine, and so you have to look at your business model and see what kind of volume you are gonna really need to produce. Um, if this is a good match, 
then we definitely ask that you get in touch with us. Um, I've only got one machine just like this um, that's a true SC500 um, with this kind of hours on it. Um, we are working on some other machines, there's always stuff coming along. This video was filmed on the 30th of April 2010, so if you're seeing this way in the future, definitely get in touch with us at solventprinterconversion.com. You can email me at dave at solventprinterconversion.com or give me a call at 330-556-5485 and we'd be happy to talk about this machine or what other machines we might have out there. Um, if you give me just a minute, it looks like we're nearing the end of our print job here. Um, and I think pretty shortly after it does a little pause, we're going to get to see the print and the cut. So this is how you'd make stickers or other types of contour cut graphics, which could be a pretty cool, uh, cool product for you. Um, that's coming out pretty well. So overall, we've we've uh, we've enjoyed working on these machines. There's a lot of stuff that you can do with them, and. A lot of people enjoy the fact that you get the printer and the cutter all in one machine. If you're kind of cramped for space, it can make it a little bit easier um, so that you're not, you know, you're not having many machines and all that stuff. We'll also include a basic uh, starter rip software, which is Roland Color Choice. It's what originally shipped with this machine. Um, and in five seconds, it's going to start uh, cutting here. So, and one, two, three. Here we go, now we can watch the cutter carriage. Zoom out. There we go. And do 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 do. Just like any cutter, you've got downforce adjustments, you've got speed adjustments. Um, you can really you know, use this machine for all kinds of different stuff. Let me see. sheet cut here and see if we had this set right. That's not too bad. So there you go, there's your sticker. Um, you can kind of see, we can pull it right off. Pretty cool. So anyway, thanks for visiting. Again, this is Dave at SolvingPrinterConversion.com. Rolling SC500, pretty cool printer cutter. Give me a call if there's something we can do. Take care.